The CBI Portanovelli and Opinium launched a really interesting piece of work today, um, lots of really detailed research. What one thing jumped out to you as sort of the most interesting or surprising thing from the research? Uh, absolutely, there was so much data and insight. Um, I think one of the key things that struck me was the difference, uh, the different perceptions that, that consumers have of big versus small businesses. They almost see them as you know, completely different entities altogether. Um, when you look at the list of top five of sort of things you attribute to big business and small business, they are completely different, um, you know, so ranging from sort of local and, and, and family run and, and, and potentially struggling from small businesses to board of directors and uh, you know, exist to make a profit, etc., when, when actually they're all achieving, uh, trying to achieve the same thing. So potentially some lessons, of course, can be learned uh, by small businesses about big businesses and, and opposite way round two. So I thought that was, you know, just under that sort of top line of insight, there's some really interesting bits and pieces that can be derived from the data when we dig down. Thanks, James. Um, and we had lots of business leaders today here at the event. Um, what would be your sort of message or one piece of advice that you would give to any sort of, of the CEOs that were here today? What one thing could they do to sort of make a difference? I, I think based on, on some of the research we saw around an, an employer being being one of the most important uh, most important uh, sort of factors uh, for for generating more higher levels of trust and reputation I think it, uh, as an employer get out there uh, on the shop floor in the office whatever it takes and talk to your people communicate with them I know there's some fantastic examples of course of business leaders doing that but I think we could always do it more we could always get out there and talk the talk as well as walk the walk of course and I think another one really was about um, communicating the why uh, uh, what you do uh, as a business or rather why you do it not just what you do and how you do it how you make things and what you make but why you do it why you get up in the morning because uh, that will really inspire people and I think you know the workforce is crying out to be inspired they want to they trust their employers um, and I think that could be a, a real key thing to do you know tomorrow morning quite easy to do